everybody, it's Christy back with another video and today we are going to unbox the June Blackwing subscription box. I really enjoy getting the Blackwing volumes boxes once a quarter. I hope that you enjoy watching me unbox them. Uh, let's go ahead and see what's inside. I did take the teeth off it here, but I didn't actually open this box yet. Ooh, so we have some really pretty yellow stuff in here. And this is... Blackwing Volumes 57. Blackwing Volume 57, the Jean Michel Basquiat pencil. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, but let's read a little bit about that. So, Jean Michel Basquiat is one of the best known artists of his generation and is widely considered one of the most important artists of the 20th century. I've definitely heard his name before, but um, you guys know I'm kind of a, a hobbyist, right? So, this is new to me. So his works are edgy and raw through a bold sense of color composition. Very cool. He maintains a fine balance between seemingly contradictory forces, such as control and spontaneity, menace and wit, or urban imagery, imagery and primitivism. That's cool. So the 57 is a tribute to him and his boundary pushing art. The number 57 is a reference to 57 Great Jones Street in New York City, where Basquiat created some of his best-known works. Well, that's pretty cool. Let's take a look at the pencils. Ooh, so we've got all of these cool erasers in here. I don't know if they're replacements or not. Let's look. Okay, so this one comes with a black eraser, which there aren't any black erasers in here. And it says, finish untitled skull okay which is like probably the, the painting that's being used here i think that's what we see on the box here yep see it wrapped around the box did we get a print of it because that would be really cool if we did i'll look in there in a second feral and clip is gold and crown black eraser and white imprint and it doesn't say oh graphite is soft which makes sense for an artist pencil so that's pretty cool and the imprint, which we can't I'm trying to wiggle this pencil so we can see it. I do not see it. We'll just let's open the box. Is there an art print in here? Oh, boo, there's not. I'm a little disappointed by that. I would really have liked to have a just like a postcard size print of this piece of art. I do like that we got some replacement erasers. It's always nice when we get something that we can use directly with the pencils as our freebie. Oh, look, there is a little crown, like, on there. That's really neat. So see that little detail of the crown? Super cool. And then we have a black eraser, and there's the white writing on there. And, yeah, that's a beautiful pencil. So we will go ahead and sharpen one and take a second to play around in our book with one here. And... Yeah, that is the unboxing of the pencils. I really enjoy getting these, and I think that they're really fun colors in this particular box. Really, really neat. So let's go ahead and just do a quick sketch with this, and we'll talk about it at the end. Oh, 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 
right, so just coming back on to wrap up this Blackwing Volumes 57 box, I just sat down and doodled a little bit, nothing spectacular. I figured I'd list you my top five summer plans, which are we're going on a family vacation, our anniversary, we will be married 15 years, which is so cool. Uh, what else? World Watercolor Month, which at the time that this will release will have started. Hopefully you're playing along with that. I think it's always a really fun time to challenge ourselves to a daily art challenge once in a while. YouTube planning. I'm looking forward to that just because this is my uh, least busy time of year. And so being able to plan for the future of the channel is exciting. And last but not least, canning fresh vegetables and fruits. That's kind of my big summer hobby. I like to make pickles and jams and things like that. And so I get to do a lot of that between the months of about May and September, October here in Western Pennsylvania. So uh, do you do any canning? I'd love to know that. Or did you get this box and what did you think of it? Or do you have another artist that you would like to see Blackwing do a volumes box for? Let me know any and all of those things in the comments below. And that's going to be it for me today. I hope that you enjoyed watching this quick unboxing of our Black Wings volumes. And we will see you guys in the next video. Bye for now.